Hey guys. guys, welcome back to the Milan family. So today is a really exciting day. We're getting a new, a new car. car. The girls have no idea what it looks like. We haven't shown them like any pictures or anything. So it's gonna be a complete surprise. Yeah. What do you think it looks like? I don't know. What color do you think? I don't know. You have no idea? No, I don't know what it's gonna look like yet. Yeah, all we told her is that it's a bigger car. As you guys have seen in previous vlogs, we tried to fit three car seats across in our car. We currently have a Chrysler and it just, it didn't work out unfortunately. I tried so hard, I tried like different seats, I tried like different combinations, I tried um, not using like the lower anchors and it was just a really tight fit so I caved in and we're getting a new car. This vlog is also gonna be the start of Baby Watch because it's finally October. So you know what October means? Mm -hmm. Who's coming this month? There you go. Yeah, My sister's your sister's gonna come this month. Mm -hmm. So I'm officially declaring Baby Watch because I'm 36 weeks pregnant. Mm -hmm. We're almost there, right? Yeah. Excited? Yeah. So there's a few things I want to get done too. I still have to put away all of the baby shower stuff. I still haven't done that. I was supposed to do that last week, but I just didn't get around to it. I still need Benny to build a cubby shelf for me because I'm going to see if that fits inside of my closet because I bought some bins for the cubby shelf. And then I'm going to use that for extra storage for baby girl because you guys know her nursery is going to just be... <laughs> Say hi. Hi. You guys know her nursery is going to be in our Yay. room. So I'm trying to just get as much storage as I can. So I'm going to see if I can fit a cubby shelf in my closet. And if I can, then I'm going to store all of the baby shower stuff in there. Because most of the clothing size that we got for the shower isn't newborn. It's like higher up sizes. So I don't need that stuff right now. So I can just kind of like store it for later. And then I can put all of like the extra diapers and wipes in my closet. All of my extra diaper bags and just pretty much anything else I need. So there's going to be some baby prep in this vlog. I'm going to show you guys a new car. And it's the start of baby watch, right? That's a baby watch. Baby watch. Yeah. It's pretty much like countdown to baby. I'm not on full bed rest anymore though. I forgot to update you guys on that. I'm not on full bed rest. I'm still supposed to take it easy. She still doesn't want me being on my feet for like long periods of time. But I'm not like strictly, okay, I have to be like off my feet all the time now so that's a little update for you guys i did have an ob appointment yesterday as well it was my 36 week appointment i go in weekly now guys so crazy she's gonna be here so soon so yesterday my appointment went good they measured my belly they took my weight and then they also checked my heartbeat that's pretty my heartbeat <laughs> i mean the baby's heartbeat obviously so they checked the baby's heartbeat that's pretty much like all my appointments have been lately it's just like a heartbeat check weight check all of that stuff her heartbeat sounded good but her heartbeat was above like my belly button so my ob is kind of concerned that she may be breech so next week for my appointment i have to go in twice next week one for my regular ob appointment and then i'm also getting an ultrasound just to make sure that she's not breech so kind of stressing out about that a little bit. So bump update for you guys. I am 36 weeks. I'm feeling so big. She is so big in there, you guys. So here is my 36 weeks belly. I thought baby girl had dropped because she feels so low and I've been having a lot of lightning crotch. If you've had that during pregnancy, you know it is not fun. It's like sharp, shooting pains down there so not fun by any means i've been having that a lot lately especially when i'm walking it's just so uncomfortable so i had thought maybe she dropped but now that my ob is saying that there's a possibility that she might be breached i'm just kind of like second guessing everything now so i don't know we will see so here's all of the baby shower stuff 
I did film a baby shower like haul of everything. I showed you guys all of the gifts that we got and then I linked everything in that video as well. So if you guys want to see that video, I'll leave a card up here so you guys can check it out. So I think I'm going to just take everything out. I'm going to take the clothing off of the hangers. I think I'm going to leave the tags on for now because I'm not going to wash anything because like I said, all of this stuff is like three months, six months. It's just a lot of bigger sizes. So I don't want to take any tags off yet because like I said, I'm just not going to wash anything. All of this stuff is just going to be stored for right now. So I'm just going to take everything out of the bags, kind of open up some stuff because I have like a baby camera in here. I'm probably going to open up a pack of newborn diapers to put in my diaper caddy. Probably going to hang up all those hangers and just kind of finally organize this stuff. Like I said, I have a cubby shelf that Benny needs to put up, so hopefully he'll do that for me today. So here's everything. So there's some things that I want to open today, like this one. I want to set this up in my room. Um, the bottles. I'm not sure if I'm going to open those yet. The bows can be put away. Hangers can be hung. So there's just some stuff that I want to open now. And then there's some things that I'm not going to open now. So I'm going to just go through it. Like I said, I did film a haul of all of this stuff. So if you missed that, be sure to check it out because... I went into detail of everything. So, and I have my little helpers in here. You girls are gonna help me? Yeah, we have some cheeses though. <laughs> Talking to each other, I know we feel the same About the situation, like we're stuck inside a game Time to get out of this circle, yeah we both carry a scar As you write the part we're playing, time to cherish who we are The only thing I ever wanted, starts with us taking the chance Not like anything we've done before, oh, oh, yeah it's time for something better And time for us to follow our dreams No, we can't stay no more oh. Come run away Don't be afraid We'll be okay And I know it's the right thing to do Let's break away All colors will fade Let's go our own way Now's the time to decide what to do And I'll stand by you Step is always hard When you walk out of the doorway But that's just the place to start The only thing I ever wanted Starts with us taking the chance I ended up just taking off the tags off of all the clothes I figured it would just be better to do it now That way whenever baby girl does grow into this clothes I can just throw it in the wash Without having to like take off tags and stickers Hangers, all of that stuff I did end up having some newborn stuff, so I'm going to have to throw in a little load of just this stuff. And then this is three months, I believe, and then this is like six to nine months. So I'm going to store all of that stuff. I still have to figure out where I'm going to put all of this. And then here is my side of the closet. So all of this stuff has to be taken out right here. This is like all of my diaper bags. Just a random extra blanket, a boppy pillow. 
I have my baby carrier that I use for Rory. I have a baby play gym from Love Every. And then I just have like my electric pump. I have the Spectra S2. So I just have a lot of random baby things in here. So I have to clear out all of this and organize it. I think I'm going to end up taking these sleepers off the hangers and then probably roll them up and fit them inside the cubes because I plan on putting that cube shelf right here. I measured so it should fit once I take out all of this stuff. So the cube shelf is going to go right here and then I'm going to use it for storage and then I think I'm going to hang up like any fancier clothes like maybe like sweaters and coats, um, dresses, just like things that I don't want rolled inside of the bin. I think I'm going to hang it right here. So I'm going to take out all of this stuff and then move these little clothes organizer things right here. This is another thing that I want to tackle today. So I want to clear off this whole top part of the dresser. This is going to stay here, but I have to organize it, start putting some diapers in here. This is my hospital bag. This is just like a baby lounger. And then Benny has a few things on here that I have to clear out. And then these are the bins that I'm going to be using for the, the cubby shelf. And I'm just dropping everything. So these are the bins that I'm going to use. So I'm going to just clear this out because I also have um, the changing pad that's going to go on top of our dresser for baby girl. That came in the mail as well. So I want to set that up today too. I'm going to go too fast. I don't care about. baby girls changing station all ready to go for the most part there's still some stuff that I want to hang up right here but I just haven't ordered it yet because I haven't found like the shelving like that I want I just haven't found one that I liked or like a picture that I like so far so it's gonna be kind of just bare for now but that's what it looks like I set up the hatch already it took me like one minute because the girls already have a hatch machine so I already have the app on my phone, so it was really easy to set up. So I already programmed it. I already named it after baby girl and everything. So that's all ready to go. I have her diaper caddy here. I have the haka. I'm not going to open it yet, so I just stuck it in here. I have some body wash, some lotion. I have the little seatbelt for the changing pad. And then I opened just one pack of newborn diapers some wipes right here and then here is the changing pad that i went with it's so much softer than i thought it was i don't know why i thought it was going to be like harder but this feels so comfy like it kind of feels like memory foam 
not sure if it is, but that is the one that we went with. It's the Kikaru, if you guys are wondering. So I'm just so excited, and I'm so glad that I went with this color because I was debating on getting the gray color. But I'm so glad that I went with that one because it matches perfect with the diaper caddy. Ah, our new car is getting delivered right now. That's right there. Do you guys see it? Yeah. What do you guys think? <laughs> no, it's our car. It looks like Grandma's car. But it's I told you it was going to be big like Grandma's car. You guys know like Grandma Julie cars? Yeah. What do you girls think so far? We like it. You like it? Are you excited? Yeah. You like it too, Rory? You like it, Rory? Yep. We're going to do the ultimate test drive today. Taking the family on a grocery run. <laughs> you got to check out the trunk space as a family. Make sure it's all good. We have like a... How many days do we have to test it out? We got a whole week. Some, so we have a whole week. If for some reason we don't like it, they will come pick we it can, up, right? Yeah, and, and then, then we, we can, can either trade it out for like a car that's equal to the same price or whatever we got approved for the loan for. Mm -hmm. And then if not, if we don't really want to go with them anymore, we can just get a full refund within yeah. those seven days. As long as we, so we have, we get a test drive it for 400 miles mm -hmm. for the first week. Uh, I can't we go, even see your face. <laughs> if we go over the 400 miles, then it voids our seven day warranty, our seven days, like, Money back or whatever? Yeah, yeah. And then if we get an accident, obviously, then the car's ours. So, <laughs> but I'm a professional car driver. I don't know if you guys knew that or not. <laughs> yeah, Benny does all the driving in the family, right, babe? Yep. I, I haven't even shown you what I've done in the room, too. No. I was organizing all of baby girl stuff. Nice. So I need you to build me that cube shelf. Can you guys see the Call of Duty in the background? Oh, yeah, you can. <laughs> They're letting it down. And it just slides all the way out. <laughs> See? What do you think, Rory? Are you excited? Why does it look like in the sky? We'll find out when we go inside. Mm -hmm. It's exciting. It's ex exciting. Oh, it's sliding? Oh, it's sliding. I thought you were saying it's exciting I too. I thought it was running away. <laughs> <laughs> Look at, like look at his face, you guys. He's so happy right now. Come on, let's go see the new car. Come on, come on. Daddy's already in it. Come on, come on. Wow, look at it. It's so nice. Look at Ryan. Wow. What do you That's think? My car. That's our car. <laughs> Woo. <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's so much nicer than I thought it was gonna be. Yeah. Wow. So we got three rows. Yeah, baby, hold on. So I think we're going to put baby girl here. Yeah. Rory there, and then probably Layla in the back since Layla knows how to buckle. Woo, excited. You ready to go grocery shopping? I'm pretty excited to go oh, grocery right, shopping. Yeah. <laughs> you guys, Rory, stop digging for gold. Here, mommy help you. Whee! Mommy help you. Ready? One, two. Woo! All right. Woo! What do you think? You like it? Woo! Ready to have your little AC blowing at you. Yeah, look, you guys got AC vents back here now, and you guys can control it. Can we close it? Which is going to be so nice for the summers, especially for baby girls so she doesn't sweat. There's vents back here too. Ah, what do you think, babe? I like it. I like you can turn it off. It's so nice. <laughs> First drive in the new car. The girls are loving it so far. I love the new car. You love it? The inside and outside. Ready? So we're back home now. I had to throw my hair up because it's so hot outside. We ended up going grocery shopping. The groceries fit really good in the car. So everything seems to be good. We're so excited. So all of the groceries are put away, which means I'm gonna 
go ahead and finish all of this baby stuff because it's kind of taking over my whole bed right now. So I'm going to set up all of the little cube bins and then I'm going to start putting I'm going to start putting everything in them. That way whenever Benny builds that shelf for me, I can just put all of the cubes in and I'll be good to go. closet i was over here setting up our lollipop camera i ran into a bit of a problem when i was setting it up i guess the baby little crib that we have the bars are kind of thick so i was really struggling to get this to wrap around it's like barely on i mean it's kind of snug on here i don't think baby girl is going to be able to take it down at all but i had a problem getting in there i don't know if you guys can tell but the end of the stick is just in here so i'm hoping it holds might have to change it whenever she gets older but obviously she's not going to be messing with it right now so i think it's fine for now but yeah i was kind of struggling with that but i think it's all good i set it up to my phone and everything too so now i just have to figure out where to put all of this stuff there's just so much stuff. I didn't realize how much baby stuff we had until I kind of just threw it out everywhere. Is it all set up, babe? Yep. Woo, thank you. Let's see how it looks. Woo, it looks good. It fit perfect. So here's the little cubby shelf. I have some storage up here too, which is nice. So I'm going to show you guys what's in them. So this one is like all of my breastfeeding stuff. So these are like breastfeeding bags um, or the milk storage bags. <laughs> so I have some of those ones. Um, I have some right here too. And then these are just my extra parts for my pump. So I just have some breastfeeding stuff in here. This one is my breast pump and then all of the parts that I'm going to currently use for it. I also have some newborn diapers in here. And then this one right here. Oh, no, one of my pom poms fell off. Anyways, so this one right here is literally all wipes. There's so many wipes in there. And then this top one right here is like random stuff. So I have a portable sound machine in here, some bottles in here. My haka is in here, and then I have some... A haka. a haka is a little breast pump. Oh. And I have some books in there. And then this one is all clothes. 
it's like three months and up so that's why i stored them in here and then this last one is just hangers i think i'm officially done for today i really need to sit i am in a lot of pain right now so i'm gonna just kind of give you guys an overview of what i did today so i set up the hatch machine i set up her little diaper caddy i forgot to show you guys this bag too but i have like all of her little essentials in here so her comb is in here her nail clippers in here her brush so i have that there i set up the changing pad i added these little booties in here i put some more bows in here and then the little stash of newborn clothes that i had from our baby shower I put them in here, that way I can use them. And then I put her little lounger right here for now. I'm still not gonna open up the stroller because it's not like we're really going anywhere anyways. So I'm gonna just keep that in the box for now. I had one of you guys ask me on Instagram if this was like required by the hospital to have your car seat wrapped up like that. It is not, that is just the way we are keeping the car seat right now. I don't like to install car seats too early on in my pregnancy because God forbid we were to get in a, into a car accident, we would have to replace the entire car seat. So I always just put that in the car last minute. So I just have it wrapped up right now. That way it doesn't get all dusty and dirty. I set up baby girl's little lollipop camera. I'm not gonna put on any crib sheets yet because I feel like it's still a little bit too early. And then for the closet, this is what I'm working with right now. So I have the extra diapers right here. I like to keep those in the boxes and then open as I need them. I have baby girl's bathtubs right here. This is the one we're going to use when she's bigger and then this one when she's a newborn. And then I already showed you guys everything that's in there. I have my hospital bag right there. This is the current little bag that I'm using as like my purse slash diaper bag. And then this is like my actual diaper bag that I'm going to use once baby girl's here and I have to carry around like a lot of stuff. I have my Ergo baby carrier right here. And then I originally bought these to put on top of like her changing station on top of my dresser, but they didn't fit on top of my dresser since I already have the diaper caddy, the hatch, the changing pad. So I'm not sure where to put these, but they are so gorgeous so i have to use them somewhere all right guys well that is it for this video i'm gonna go ahead and end it here i am like hurting so bad i am dealing with a lot of um lightning you know what as i was explaining to you guys earlier i'm getting it so bad right now so i don't know if i've just been on my feet for too long because we did go grocery shopping like i said so probably should rest for a little bit because it hurts so bad Feels like she's just like punching me and kicking me down there, but I'm gonna go in and end it. What did you think about today, Lay? About our new car? Mm -hmm. like the new car. Yeah, what's your favorite part about it so far? Everything. Everything? What about you, little one? She's over there watching her YouTube videos. <laughs> Rory, what'd you think of the new car? Thumbs up? Yeah? What about you, Benjamin? You like the new car? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> as always if you guys enjoyed this video make sure you give it a thumbs up make sure you guys are subscribed to the Moran family and make sure you hit that bell that way you guys always get notified every single time we upload and we'll see you guys in our next video bye where you want to say bye bye <laughs> when I see you my heart starts racing but I don't